Hi everyone, Coyote Montana here, and I've got another Blu-ray plus Blu-ray plus DVD unboxing to, to do. This is The Cat Returns. Yes, The Cat Returns from 2002, the year that Scooby-Doo came, the live one. So my dad actually got this off, off of Amazon that I got on Christmas. Because I actually never seen this before, but it looks good. I've seen the trailers of it on YouTube and everything. And you know, to be honest, I actually noticed that there is that these that G Kids is actually releasing these things in, in limited edition steel books. But to be honest, I actually never get them. Because I just love sticking with the standard Blu-ray case. Yeah, that's that's how I am, everyone. So there's actually no sticker there, but no worries about that. So Disney actually released this on Blu-ray and DVD years ago. And it has like a different artwork because that was the, the original. This one here from G Kids is like a new one. Yes, so G Kids actually used the same, some of the same artwork like how Disney does, but at times they actually use different artwork like this one here. It looks so good. If you remember what the the first one really looked like, be sure to look at it closely between the difference between that one from Disney and this one from G Kids. Anyways, let's take a good look. We got the front cover here. Here's the spine. It looks really nice, and here's the back. Yep, and it's about this girl named Haru. That's her right there. And this is and this is somehow she went to a place that is full of cats. Wow, cats. And look, there's that's her when she became a cat. Wow. You know, that's why I called becoming a Neko, of course. Ha, huh, Neko's gotta gotta love them, Neko's. Cats, of course. Anyways, let's get this open. I mean, you know, since I mentioned about cats, because, you know, for Super Mario 3D World slash plus Bowser's Fury, I really like that Bowser's Fury, that Mario's at a place that's, that are, that are, like, that everything's like all cats. That goes, of course. Hmm. Just like how they did with Anime Bro Me. Now, there's no double, s now, there's no plastic on the Blu-ray case, that's, which is actually different. I'm not upset about that, but looks fine to me, of course. There's like a paper there, so I'm gonna get this open and... Oh, what's this? Is there like something... Wow! This is some, some like a, some sort of a poster! Wow! And look at that, it's all in Japanese there! But just to be honest, I can't read Japanese. Just to be honest. I love it. Looks really nice. So here's the booklet here, and look, and let's take a good look. And it says how to get along with Hayao Miyazaki. All right, so this is from the producer of July 2013. There's the cat who actually helped out Haru. Love, love the pic, love the art there. Oh, there's Haru on the laying on the grass, just like the one, just like the one on this poster here. Yeah, you can actually hear something out there. <laughs> Numb skull neighbors. All right, so there are the discs, the DV and to be honest, the DVD disc looks good there, and the Blu-ray looks so good. And as you take these off, check it out. There's the there's the the, the street where the house is, and there's and there are the and there are the cats right there. Wow, it looks really really nice. I can't wait to watch this. It's gonna be really really great. I wish the key program would actually watch this because it's a, it's a really good anime film that Studio Ghibli have did. And believe me, it's good. So good. Ugh, come on. Yeah, believe me. It's hard to get these on because of the because the because this thing here is trying to I don't know. Ugh, there we go. Lock it. Be sure to hit the subscribe button, hit the like, send some comments, and hit the bell button for brand new videos, and I'll see you next time. 
Peace out, everyone. Bye.